So we're absolutely not trying to eliminate the, the realtor. There, there, there's absolutely a value for this. Or in some ways, we're trying to superpower the realtor as well as give them tools that they can never. So for instance, if you were trying to move from well, Orange County up to, to, to Danville, where I am, and you asked your realtor, hey, can you help me? I need to sell my house first. Can I borrow a, a one and a half million dollars? I'm pretty sure they're not going to say, <laughs> like, sure, here you go. Yeah, you know, um, there are a few things. I think the first thing is all of the regulations and uh, and all of the constructs, including how much capital you need, how many deposits you can take, all of this is designed for really large financial institutions. And when we went through the financial crisis, all of the regulators doubled down on making it you know, pretty difficult for the big banks to fail. Um, but what they inadvertently did is they made it almost impossible for the smaller banks to be able to compete, to, to, uh, to be sustainable and to grow. 